Good morning. Sunday morning. Happy Sunday. Welcome to Education, and welcome to another episode of You Laugh, You Lose. If you are new to this channel and new to this series, the game is very, very simple. If you laugh at anything in today's video, you lose and you have to do a punishment. What is today's punishments? Last week, you had to eat that thing on Joe Biden's face, whatever it was. I hope you did it if you lost. This week, if you lose, your punishment is you have to drink only pumpkin spice lattes from now until Halloween. No water, no milk, no beer, nothing. Just pumpkin spice lattes, all right? That's it. A terrible punishment, I know, but it is what it is. If you accept the terms of today's game, head down and like this video. And if you are new here, please make sure you are subscribed and have the bell clicked for notifications when new videos are uploaded. Now on to today's game. If you laugh, you lose, go. I don't care if you're a doctor, an engineer, or a rocket scientist. Nobody gets the produce bag open on the first try. The produce bag and the doggy pickup bag, if you know what I'm talking about. None of you get it on the first try, I'll guarantee it. And if you videotape yourself doing it on the first try, you could win a million Bitcoins. So videotape yourself, send it to me, however you want to. Men back in the days. Men today. That is a fact check true. Um, Some of you ladies, you might like that, I don't know, but not very intimidating when you go to the battlefield. How to survive working a job you hate. <laughs> Just drinking occurs. Drinking occurs with a straw. I feel like it's a little bit easier to mix some vodka into something. I'm not saying you should do that, by the way. You should not be doing that on the job. You should just find a new job. Maybe stop drinking altogether, because that's not a good sign. But uh, if curs is all you got, you got to go curs. Me. I don't need a grocery cart. Six minutes later. Every single time this happens. Just grab the cart right off the bat. Usually I go for the, the little hand cart, you know? the little basket but don't end up like this guy because it happens every time you're gonna do that cyclists ride in the middle of the road or ride in the middle of the road <laughs> i saw some of you comment last time about my cyclist hate look i don't hate cyclists good for you for being out there doing something just get out of the middle of the damn road and quit straddling the line you got five feet of the bike lane Use the far side of it so you're out of the road, man. Come on. Every year, sharks kill 10 people. Every year, 100 people die from being stepped on by cows. Cow week. Is that a real fact? 100 people a year? I mean, I believe it, but... If that's the case, we need to start having cow week. Screw shark week. Me as a wife. Husband. Welcome home. I'm hiding in the house with a Nerf gun. Here's the other one. The loser cooks dinner tonight. May the odds be ever in your favor. XOXO, wife. I'm just going to go ahead and say that this is not fair. Like, he's got to go and clear the rooms like that. I mean, you have such an advantage. You could be camping out. Who knows? You could have a plan to ambush him. This isn't fair. So, husband, I hope you don't play by those rules. Otherwise, you're cooking dinner. She said no. I wonder why. You went to great lengths, man. Great lengths. <laughs> By the way, dude, look at your shoes. Maybe that's why she denied you. Looks like you have one on the wrong foot. I mean, they're obviously different shoes, but you have one on the wrong foot. I don't know why she said no, dude. Saw an absolute relic today. One of the greatest toys of all time. Seeing this image unlocked a memory I didn't even know I had. That is one of the all-time great toys. If you're a 90s kid, you know what this is. You probably had it at your daycare. Maybe you had it at your house. This thing was amazing. Do toys like this even exist anymore? I feel bad for kids today. They got to miss out on this. Go fund me in 1989. That was go fund me in like 1999 as well. And, you know, you're riding around on your bikes trying to collect cans. That's how you do it. That's how you make money. Now, kids just steal their Apple password from their parents. And that's it. That's how they do it. The most dangerous game to play. Resting your eyes in the morning after shutting off your alarm. Just get up. 
the sleep you get after that first beep too, when you wake up, it's not quality sleep. So just get up on the first beep. It's not helping you. Easier said than done, I know, but don't do this. I've been there. How I be looking at the cashier when they ask if I want to donate to a children's charity. <laughs> it's not so much that you don't want to, right? I mean, everyone, okay, yeah, it's a children's charity. I want to help them out, right? It's the fact that you're getting guilted into it every time you just go and pick up some cat litter. Do you want to donate to the children's fund? And then you have to say no, and then you have to live with that because you know that you have to say no and live with that guilt, and most people can't do it. So you're guilting them, you're coercing them into donating. I hate it. So if you can straight face, stone cold, say no like this, I respect you. Do it on your own terms. Help out on your own terms. Don't get suckered into it. My car broke down outside of Pizza Hut earlier today, so I ordered a pizza to be delivered to my house and got a lift from the driver. There you go. That's genius. Good for you. Anyone that gets in this situation, there's options. Although an Uber might have been a little bit cheaper depending on how far it was. But you do got dinner now too. Can anyone explain this? Um, Looks? Which doesn't make sense either because they don't even have a cover over that tire. If it wanted to look cool, get, get a cool cover for it. Halloween 2021, be like. If you don't know what Squid Game is, this is where that's from. You're going to see this at any party you go to. You're going to see probably, my estimation, I said 50% before, but I'm going to go 33%. One third of people are going to be dressed up like Squid Game. And then there's going to be like a five-ish percent that are still doing that Harley Quinn thing. Um, and then, you know, you got the mixed bags everywhere else. But expect this this year. Realizing 2022 is three months away while I'm still processing 2020. You just got to suck it up, man. You just got to grind through it. 2020 sucked. Yeah, whatever. Every, it sucked for everyone. 2021, it's sucking for a lot of people, but it doesn't have to. You can you can grind through this. 2022 is right around the corner, so get with it or uh, go sleep in mommy's basement, I guess. I don't know. You know you're all grown up when you actually pick up the ice cube instead of kicking it under the fridge. Oh, it's the best. It's funny because I've done that and now I'm feeling shameful. Just pick it up. Or have a dog. Dogs love ice cubes for some reason. YouTube cancels Rewind for good after years of everyone hating it. The entire internet. Ah, victory. <laughs> yes. Oh, that's a round of applause for that one. YouTube Rewind was absolutely garbage for the last few years. I think last year they just did like a top... 10 or 20 for categories. It was really stupid, really half-assed. Year before that, everyone was pissed, obviously. Hopefully PewDiePie does one. PewDiePie, just give me a shout out, please. Just throw me like, just a flash. That's it, I want half a second. But yes, this is a huge win for the internet. Good job, guys, good job. For that special man you want in your life. <laughs> Bacon scented chloroform. <laughs> oh man, that's uh, messed up, but kind of genius too, for being honest. When someone sends you the same Snapchat as their story. Yeah, why do you do that, guys? Why? I, I just, I fail to understand that sometimes. I'm not on Snapchat much anymore. But uh, yeah, you, you send it in the DM and also post it to the story. But the people that got the DM are also going to see it on the story. So, it, I don't know, it doesn't seem as meaningful when you Snapchat the, an individual. Me looking at Squid Game memes, also not knowing what the F Squid Game is. You guys, I've said this before. Squid Games is worth your time. All right, go watch it. It's pretty good. I, I don't want to hype it up too much, but it, I think it is worth the hype that is going around on the internet. Go watch it. Until you work in food or retail, you have no idea the level of stupid that exists in the world. That's a fact check true. I used to be a dishwasher. I used to be a host. Uh, there's a lot of stupid out there. A lot. Every kid should work at a restaurant at some point. I, I truly believe that. Me every Sunday mentally preparing myself for Monday. <laughs> Another Squid Games meme. This is, this is true for a lot of people. I've been there a lot. <laughs> When you look up the lyrics to a song and realize you've been singing nonsense for six months. I hate that. And then you can't listen to that song anymore because you know what the lyrics are. 
even though that tune is really catchy. When it's 24 hours till payday, dude, just don't even do that. Just hop in the shower. September 25th, 1926, Henry Ford announces the eight hour, five day work week. Everyone boo this man. Is that true? I don't even know if that's true or not, but uh, hmm. if I were you and you had the option, you, you always go four tens or three twelves. I mean, that's a no brainer. If you have that option, do that. What is he trying to do? Watch his step. Hmm. I've seen this. This is, this is bad. That's a candidate for dumb joke of the day. Legend says the husband was waiting in the car for his wife to get ready. It's believable. <laughs> Love you, wife. But uh, I've been here. I've had to brush the moss off the car a couple times, just so you know. Breaking. John Gruden identifies as Hunter Biden, so media will ignore <laughs> his emails. <laughs> it is a little bit funny how they pick and choose who they want to cover when, you know, when it fits the narrative. But, uh, and I'm not defending what John Gruden said in his emails, except what he said about Biden. That was kind of funny, you have to admit. But, uh, yeah, how come they don't care about Hunter? Still, his emails. Pretending to be a sophisticated tea drinking adult while in a Zoom meeting, when really, Okay, this is respectable. Don't eat all of it. You might get a bellyache. But uh, it's better than having some swish in there. If you're in the morning doing a, a Zoom meeting at work and you have some swish in there, you got problems. Seek help. Americans getting ready to buy a loaf of bread circa 2022. God, I really hope that inflation doesn't get this bad, but the report came out last week. Uh, and it wasn't good again. So, I mean, this is what happens when you print trillions and trillions of dollars. It's basic economics, basic money supply. But uh, yeah, I hope this is not the case. It's looking like it though. MySpace was probably the best social media time period ever. No ads, no influencers, clout chasing, just vibes, creativity, and coding. All right, there's truth to this. But at the same time, if you remember MySpace, you could rank your friends and everyone did. So this place was made to break up friendships. You could top 10 your friends, all right? Then you got pissed at people for having the same song as you. Then you could have anonymous message boards and you scroll down and it would say like, F you, you idiot. I mean, it was made for cyber bullies. It truly was, although it was really cool. I wish you could customize your page like that. You're not completely useless. You can always serve as a bad example. Until we meet again. Think about that. Your life might be terrible. You might be a bad person, but you still could be, you could still serve as a bad example for other kids. Teach them what not to do, which is a good thing. So technically you're not bad. William Chandler, a South African pilot, had to resign after it was found he had a fake license. He was flying for the last 20 years. Could have just given him a real one at that point. 20 years of a fake pilot. I already hate flying enough. This is about the last story I want to see. How many other pilots are out there like this flying us around? This is terrifying. Online lecture. Gene, yes. Genius. Zoomers out there. All of you in college... You want to take a nap? Do this. Little bro pulled up to his whole crib missing. Sucks, man. Godspeed. This iPhone generation will never understand the struggle of pressing a button three times to get one letter. Those were the days. Um, if you watch the podcast, we talked about doing this, going back to the dumb phones. I swear to God, I'll do this. Does anyone know where we can get these? I, I tried to look this one up. Couldn't find it. Does anyone out there still have a dumb phone? Because if you do, respect. When they keep stealing your food at work, it's disgusting, but you got to do what you got to do. If you got any uh, hawksters out there stealing your food at lunch, do this. This is a devastating discovery. Palm oil, skim milk powder, cocoa, hazelnuts, sugar. Oh, damn. I thought the ultra sweet chocolate nut spread was healthy. <laughs> it is. A fact that that's awful for you. It's good, but bad. When you are Southwest Airlines, and you're the only one getting bad weather, 
they still came out and defended it, you know, saying, I always bad weather and uh, air traffic control delays, even though every other airline uses the same airports and didn't have thousands of cancellations. Totally makes sense. Y your story is so believable, Southwest. Burger King sending shots. Work for a king, not a clown. I think this is like the third one I've seen of Burger King talking crap to McDonald's. But I'll say it again. Burger King, you are not on the level of McDonald's. And I'm sorry, but it's just true. The only thing I like at Burger King more than McDonald's are those breakfast wraps you have in the morning. That's it. McDonald's is miles ahead of you in food. Even though none of us should be eating at either place, all right? I'm no car guy, but there has to be a better way. I'm going to go ahead and guess that this is California. Could be downtown Minneapolis. I don't, maybe. When the government is about to default on its own $28 trillion debt, but also wants to track the 600 bucks in your account. Hold up, mother truckers. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's the problem, guys. All those, everyone paying over $600 transactions under 10 grand. It's not reported to the IRS. That's the problem. That's the reason we're in debt. It has nothing to do with any of these people hiding their money in offshore accounts and like in the Pandora and the Panama Papers. None of that. And those are the people that are making these rules for us. It's hilarious. When your friend is raving about some Netflix show and you got to pretend like you're considering watching it, I'll put it on my list. <laughs> I literally say this all the time. Yeah, I'll add it to the list. And I never watch it. I mean, I want to, but the list is endless. So my reaction to literally everything right now, it's a crazy time out there. If this is you, that means your brain's working. Um, you're probably going nuts watching it all go down, but at least you have some common sense left. The average person falls asleep in seven minutes. Who? Who the F are these people? <laughs> if that's you, I am incredibly envious of you. I wish I could fall asleep like that. And I know a few people, their head hits the pillow and they're out. But I, pff, I lay there for a couple hours usually. If you do not know what you're doing, neither does your enemy, Joe Sue. Art of a war. Learn it. If you don't know what you're doing, neither do they. So, Joe... You got something going for you. Joe Biden leaving office in 2024, like. Um, is he going to make it that long? That's an honest question. Are they going to, you know, 25th him before that? It seems like it, but families speak out as COVID-19 Delta variant proves dangerous for pregnant people. Pregnant people? Read that headline again. Some hate women so much that they literally want to erase even the word woman from our vocabulary. Tulsi, speaking some truth. I love this. It's crazy though that the conundrum they're in. Women's rights, women's empowerments, or erase women. Erase women's empowerments. Which is it? If you don't do this at your house, you too rich for me. Use the bags in the garbage cans? All right, I do that, so I guess I'm not too rich for you. Hello, I ordered a lamp from you, but I never got it. You can provide a photo or video proof that you really did not receive it. <laughs> it could be a smart ass, Tom. Try to remember the greener grass across the fence may be due to a septic tank issue. <laughs> it's actually true. Could be. Also, don't be one of those people. Don't be a grass is always greener person. I, I hate that so much. Trust the critics. Look at that. F Fauci's down to 2%. Wow. Dave Chappelle, 97% audience score. That's amazing. It's always like this. Why? This detachment from Hollywood, the critics, the people trying to push the message versus the audience. The audience is always polar opposite. Ruin Halloween with chocolate covered Brussels sprouts. No, don't do that. The greatest 45 seconds of flavor that you will ever experience. That is a fact check true. Does this stuff still exist, by the way? This was amazing when I was a kid playing baseball. I grew up living paycheck to paycheck, but through hard work and perseverance, I now live direct deposit to direct deposit. You made it. You made it. Congrats. Can't stop thinking about this couple 
who had to make a fake lap for their clingy cat so they could get work done. <laughs> we might have to do this. I don't know why. We have a clingy cat too, and it does this all the time. Tis the season. Ooh, I smell a children. Whoa, ladies, that's my job. <laughs> get your hands away from them kids, Joe. Quit sniffing them. They're just kids. It's disgusting. Harmless prank. Draw a spider on a roll of toilet paper. Might be kind of interesting, Atri. Uh, I endorse this. Do this. Videotape it and post it. That's great. Dave Chappelle has literally never been funny. <laughs> exactly what you would expect on a post like that. Exactly. Let's go, Brandon. Let's go, Brandon. Let's go. They'll spend trillions on bills they haven't read, but want details on how you spend $600. Uh, this was actually fact-checked, you guys. This isn't true, obviously, but it probably is true. There's no way in hell they're reading 5,000 pages of really dry writing in a few days. That's just not happening. So, yes, they're not reading the bills, and they don't care. They don't care where the trillions go, but they do care about the $600 transactions in your accounts. People who live in Michigan's Lower Peninsula get to use their hands to explain where they live. Don't ask what Floridians have to use. Grow up. This is true about uh, Michigan though. Every person I've ever met from Michigan, it's like, oh, what part of Michigan? Oh, you okay, you see the, the thing here? This is this Michigan, right? I'm like right here. Every time. When they don't like your viewpoints, but still peek at your timeline. See, this is an accomplishment. I love this. I love seeing people that uh, like to talk crap, leave comments, whatever, because the joke is on them, right? They're the ones listening to what you have to say and commenting on your post when no one's listening to what they have to say, right? I mean, it's kind of funny when you just want to be loved, but you're a little psycho. It's okay, Michael. There's somebody out there for you. Stay strong, bro. Banana bread. Follow me for more recipes. I'm going to give this one dumb joke of the day. I know we're not done, but that's bad. I'll get gas in the morning is one of the worst decisions you can make as an adult. Just do it now. If there's something to be done, do it now. Don't delay it. Especially this one. Like if you have to go to work in the morning, you have to get gas now. You have to. Can't breathe, can't see. Let's walk around and knock on doors. You know, I always wondered why other kids liked the mask costumes. I always did the face paint stuff because I hated this. I hated having a mask on my face because you can't breathe. You can barely see. It's uncomfortable. So, I don't know. I was never one of those mask kids. When your workplace is in chaos, but your shift is over. You just feel that release of stress as you get to see everyone else deal with it. But uh, you know what? If you what goes around is all around, as Ricky would say. So when you come back in the next day, it might come back to bite you. Who knows? Christopher Columbus died in 1506. He's ruining your happiness in 2021. You need to seek therapy. <laughs> no, but Christopher Columbus was a bad guy, man. Dude, he freaking was bad and he hurt people, man. It's freaking 500 years ago, dude. Shut up. Shut up. Seriously, this labor shortage is crazy. Look, they're down to just one boob. Hooter. <laughs> Grow up. Uh, and I do feel bad for this, this establishment. Lots of shortages out there. The official winner of the Not My Job Award... That's bad, man. Don't be lazy. Don't do this. The hell? What the hell's wrong with you? How did you do in today's video? Did you laugh at all? If you did, you lose and you have to start drinking those pumpkin spice lattes. No water, no liquor, no nothing. Just pumpkin spice until Halloween. Let me know how you did down in the comments. While you're down there, please like this video. Please help me get it recommended to others. That's it for today's video. Until next time, I'm Tyler Zed, and this is Education. For the children. Idiots.